Right, greetings all. Welcome to another edition of our trail update, our fortnightly trail update. Today we're in a very special place, um, a bit different to all our other hand-built, handcrafted trails. We're out in this wonderful world of our Clippieville trails, which I'll get, get to in a, a little bit later. But first and foremost, let me just give you all a, a trail update as to where we are, trail-wise. So by the time you, if I start out in the south, our southern trails, by the time you by the time you get this, or get to view this, this video, we would have finished the Blumendaler. Um, Eugene Haley has done a fantastic job there. It is absolutely perfect chocolate cake for you to go and ride. It is really, really nice. And that's basically Blumendal upper and lower done, uh, lower done, except other than the flow trail. And you'll be happy to know that we are, we've got something special planned there as well. We are really tweaking the flow trail, we're upping the ante, putting, taking, putting some new features and taking out, out the old ones which we're not entirely happy with. So yeah, some good stuff coming up at the, at the, at the flow trail. And then Blumendal is done, Hillcrest is done, uh, clean, riding neatly. Across to Kornemans Kloof where Rob Stark, uh, our trail landowner and trail builder extraordinaire, has done wonders with his trails. For those of you that haven't written, ridden Happy Hops, that's just below the Black Rhinos, lately, do yourself a favor and go and try it. It is superb. It's really sweet. So all the trails at Quintermans are just a pleasure. Mirandale, we've done some serious work at Mirandale as well. Bennett Nell's been really busy there. Just bear in mind, this year we're focusing on the lower section. We're not going up to the top of Dorsberg. Uh, we're all, yeah, we're only, um, we'll do that next year, but Dorsberg is clean other than the, the climb up, which we are working on. We've got something planned there, but the lower sections are Beautiful, everything is clean, neat, done. Ben has done a fantastic job and we're doing a new finish to that trail. Instead of that horrible, funny cut off camber thing that they've got there, you're getting a brand new trail, which we're starting, well, by the time you, 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 you check this video out as well, it'll be well down the line. So that's Mirandal, almost sorted. Across at the Northern Trails, Wuchkral, Velfergenucht and Fair Cape, our trail crew, the Tigerberg mountain bike uh, crew have been hired at it. And they are also producing work which stands back for nothing. Um, our, our four guys can, can really build. Um, so they're basically done. We finished the, the Cobra. Now, unfortunately, my guys got a little bit carried away with trying to turn everything to chocolate cake. They ignored my instructions to just do the drainage and keep it as rough as possible. So the first couple of corners, they almost turned into flow trail. So um, excuse me for that one. I'll take the... I'll, I'll take the bullets, but it will get gnarly, uh, it will get gnarly fairly shortly. But the bottom two thirds is rough and tough. We wanted to keep it tough, so because you've already got three fairly smooth descents down Mount Hochekral. So yeah, all trail work done and dusted, and we, it's, 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 everything's riding beautifully, especially this time of the year. All right, back on to where we are today, and this is, I wanted to chat a little about this, a little bit about this trail. This is, the Clipheville Trails. It consists of six farms, believe it or not. You, you actually go through six farms here, um, starting with Adelie down behind me, and then you get Ockeldale, Kaimans Kral, Jenskesund, Mossel Bank, which funny enough, that's the farm where the new dam has been built, and that is a fair cape, one of our, one of our fair cape farms here, um, and they built that fantastic, well it's not a dam, it's like the Kariba Dam. It's massive. And then the last farm is, now I've got a thing, Goed Gemoer. No, you can't say Goed Gemoer. Goed Gewacht. <laughs> Apologies to, 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 to the land. Yeah, Goed Gewacht. So that's the six farms that it consists of. And like a bunch of guys, um, I was approached by Philip, the, the owner at Clip Level, years ago. And he said to me, Come on, come bow. I'll try this bow. And I said, Why? And he said, Out here. And I said, Nee, here. You can't even lack a trail, these are bony. Anyhow, I got dragged out here eventually by Philip, and the moment I set foot on this place, I fell in love with it. I truly did. It is just a wonderful place to be. You're out in the middle of nowhere. Humanity, humanity is way over there. It's just you, nature. And when I built here, the, the amount of animals was incredible. There were huge herds of rebok, the amount of dakers, um, steenbuck, all around here. It's, 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 the bird life is just unbelievable. There's everything here. And of course, you're a coward too, but let's not worry about the cows. Um, 
And of course, at this time of the year, um, with everything, the flowers, nature, everything's green, I can see a couple of cyclists coming riding up the trail yeah, in amongst the wheat fields, and it's just, it's just beautiful. It's just absolutely beautiful. So yeah, every now and then, um, if you're a rider like myself, there are plenty who love gravity. Yeah? We like the rough, the gnarly, the rocks, the roots, the jumps, all that. And we've got these fantastic bikes like mine. This, this is not a bike, this is a turbo Levo. <laughs> With the 160mm suspension, front and back. You know, it's nice, it's lucky. We've got some really nice trails, rough trails, and the bikes handle it. But every now and then, it's just nice for you and your bike. Just come and have a chilled ride. Uh, where you, where you're not sweating, you're not worried about breaking your neck, you're not worried about anything, you just want to go for a ride and be out in nature. And believe me, this is a place to do it. So, yes, Patrick, me, me, Patrick actually admits in public that he likes riding on a flat trail. There, I've come out of the closet. Okay. And I'm going to get slated for it. But anyhow, that's fine. <laughs> now, seriously, um, this is a really, really nice trail to ride. It's about 15 k's long, you've got three entrances. Spetsbona Road, Malanswurte Road, and Ockelda Road. So you can mix up your ride, work, work it in with uh, Fair Cape, Freeman's Fontaine. There's various options you've got, plenty of options. And it's, get out here and ride it. It's, it really, really is tremendous. Um, right, having said that, that's about it for, for the week, for the fortnight. Um, please feel free to log any complaints, trail requests, whatnot. Uh, on our website, on our webpage, and I'll certainly look after it and take care of it like we always do. But get out there, enjoy it. It's absolutely fantastic out here. I'll see you in two weeks' time. Cheers.